What's up guys? Retro Django here. You guys are asking me about this Spitfire 500. Is it possible taking it out from my Mega 500 Plus? Beautiful, my, my Mega 5, uh, also 500, 500 Plus, that it works perfect on, and put it over to my Amiga 2000. Well, the short answer is no, but yes. No, because if you just want to put it on this original 68000 socket, you will hit this expansion slot over here. So if you just put in higher legs, then yes, it is possible to install this beauty uh, with 68000 uh, CPU that can run at 7 or 14 megahertz, 8 megabytes of fast RAM, IDE2 CF here, CF card, I think it's 8 gigabyte, 1 megabyte chip RAM, and we have got a beautiful picture here, and we will go down and choose something. Uh, let me see here. Alien Bash. Alien Breed, of course. Let's take uh, Alien Breed Special Edition. There we go. So, yes. The Spitfire 500 that will cost you about 40 euros to build works really nice in an Amiga 2000. Again, also Amiga 500 and 500 Plus. I reviewed it in my 500 Plus and you guys were asking me would it work in an Amiga 500 also? Yes. So, for you can build it at, you, I mean, at my review you have direct link to GitHub. So you can just download everything, buy the parts and build it. This will cost you 40 euros. Name another expansion for the Amiga 500 for 40 euros that will give you 8 RAM. CF card, 14 megahertz, everything man, everything. It's just 40 bucks. I love it. It works great and it's absolutely for the money. Money uh, uh, compared to what you're getting. This is the best. Nothing beats it, man. Nothing. Have a great day out there. Bye.